Yeah, you're a natural at this, Chucky. He's learning as he's pulling, literally. Alright, so we're rolling up to Pro Gear Gym here in basically what I would consider Spring Hill, Florida. And uh, what we got going on today is I'm going to be arm wrestling Sarah Backman, which I guess is the eight-time world champion woman's arm wrestling. And I'm kind of nervous. It'll be very interesting. I just kind of want to get a couple of clips with her. My buddy Devin brought her out. He's right there. And we're going to go see what we can do to make uh, some good arm wrestling happen. So I don't know exactly how it's going to go, but we'll find out. Ready to get my ass kicked. So ready. All right, unfortunately, you guys won't be able to listen to what she's telling me right now, but what Sarah is instructing me to do is more or less learn the fundamentals of arm wrestling broken down into four steps. She's going to kind of explain it. You'll see where my arms are moving and how I slide it back, roll over to the back left corner, keeping your shoulder, your bicep, and your forearm and your body super, super close and making sure that you're focusing on the hand that you're pulling with the entire time. Basically just the fundamentals. So um, we're kind of just warming up, grasping everything, instructional purpose, you know, just so you don't get hurt, no one get hurt. No one get, no one gets hurt. And um, let's say the reason being why we can't listen to this audio is because there's music playing in the gym super, super loud and I'm not trying to get copyrighted. So that's that. So we're going to have some silence or I'll probably just overlap some music right here. Well, we're not going to overlap the music. What I want to do right now is kind of just more or less continue to talk through the process of what she's instructing me. She's, like I said, teaching me the fundamentals. I'm really, really confused on some of it, but I'm also grasping at the same time. It's more or less just a lot of information because I'm used to just learning things extremely, extremely fast. And I just want to go full fledged. Like you can already tell I'm just like, all right, let's arm wrestle. Like, let's do this. I'm super excited. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. But patience is definitely needed in this so you don't get hurt. She's ex literally showing me, hey, pull your arm back, slide it to the back left corner of the pad, pull down. It's, it's going to be important. You're going to need to know this. Also, make sure you're keeping your eyes on your hand the entire time. And my ass is literally just looking at the red thing that I'm trying to pull her hand down to. So, yeah, so she's just basically saying, hey, take a break. Take five minutes. Come back. You're kind of strong. And um, you got good grip and you're understanding it very quickly. So let's meet up in five minutes and we'll do some pulls. All right, so here's where it gets fun and super, super interesting. This guy is 240 pounds. This is my real first match match. He's a little worn He's and he just competed, I guess, last Friday. Um, solid, solid guy, but this is like it. This is me learning as I go. This is my first real experience right here. So he's extremely strong. Don't let my face fool you. I'm definitely trying very, very hard. Um, but overall, yeah, he's a super, super strong dude. So now, right now, what we're going to be doing is we're switching over to left hand to kind of see what I can pull with my left hand because this left hand is still pretty much fresh. So let's skip over to that, put some music over this, and let's enjoy the show.
You gotta arm wrestle the state champ now. You wanna pull him? State champ. Left handed? Your left hand, uh, how's your left hand feel? Switch it up because you guys are set up for lefty right now. All right, so this one is gonna be a little bit more interesting. This kid's exactly my same weight, same strength-ish. Um, he's been doing this for three years now, 198 pounds, close to 200. This is our first go through right here. Um, definitely can feel how strong he is. He wanted to keep going. And I think after that, he started to actually hold me for a little while. You could just feel it. I felt it in my right rear delt how strong this kid was. And obviously I'm getting not necessarily fatigued, but I did just do a lot of left arm with two right arms with the initial guy that was 230 pounds. That's talking on the phone right there behind me. But overall, I was pretty happy with the performance that I ha had with him. I thought, I'm like, damn, this kid's got some good durability. I, little do I know anything about this, but overall I'm just like, okay, let's, let's just see how I can stack up. And instinctively, as I'm pulling, you'll hear Devin say, which you can't really hear right now, but he'll say... He's literally learning as he's pulling, like he's adapting to the atmosphere that he's being put in, like the circumstance that he's being put in. So it was a very interesting pull, um, very, very strong kid. Um, I didn't think I was gonna hold him out for that long. I think there's one time where he pulls me back a little bit and I thought he was gonna get close, but I think this is where I try to just send it. And I'm like, all right, well, my rear delt's getting really, really tired. So let's just either go for it or don't go for it. And he holds, yeah, no, he gets up right there. Okay, but super strong guy, his name's Zach, cool. All right, now we got my homie Devin. He's the one who brought me out versus Sarah. Super strong guy, 188 pounds. I mean, dude, he's just a beast all around. You can look him up. His name is Beast Aesthetics on Instagram. He's my freediving buddy. We'll probably be doing a lot of fun activities here coming up, but you can just see how wickedly strong he is. And she is no anything. She is so freaking strong. Um, she was definitely a little worn out, I believe, but um, she's got some great endurance. And she does this move where she grabs your pants. It's just wild, but Devin's super strong, man. <laughs> So we finally have the opportunity to go hand to hand with her. So let's see what I can make of this. We're still kind of warming up. We did our wrist rolls and everything of that sort. We're gonna start feeling it and we're gonna dive into it here very, very shortly. She's just explaining me the motion, getting my body tight again, just kind of relaying everything that she kind of went over at the beginning to make sure that I actually still have it. Um, let's see what happens here though. Like she was super strong. I was kind of intimidated by her, honestly. Obviously an eight time world champion, I'm like, what the hell am I getting myself into? Hopefully my arm doesn't break, you know, just a lot of variables. But overall, I was pretty confident. So let's kind of dive in and see what we can make happen right here. She's explaining the pad. And I'm just gonna shut my mouth for one sec and kind of watch with you guys as we go through here. Um, okay, I remember this, okay. Yep, keep as tight as I possibly can, keep my body behind it as I'm going to press down, which is a very, very, very smart thing to do. I wish I can have the audio of her talking for you guys, but unfortunately, due to copyright things, there's a lot of music playing in the background, as we have arm wrestling playing in the background as well on the big screen. Um, yeah, let's just get right into the action. All right, so here it is. This is the actual clip where me and her go at it. I'm gonna shut my mouth and let you guys watch a little bit of arm wrestling.
All right, so what does this mean now? It's me versus my homeboy, Devin, who's been arm wrestling since he was like 13 years old or 10 years old or something like that. Super, super strong. We started off with lefties right here. And you can see we're both struggling, but I knew right here in my head, we're still going, but I'm like, I don't have the durability that he has and he's gonna be able to pull me. Like, this isn't gonna be too hard for him. But I'm like, I haven't lost yet to anyone. So I'm like, let's not start now. And Devin just, gosh, dude, he can pull and he is strong. So we're pulling, we're pulling, and I, I mean, I just, dude, my wrist, wrists are powerful. All right, so I just got done editing it. There was a video, that was the experience I got to kind of enjoy out there right after free diving. Um, I think I'm gonna start trying to do some arm wrestling. Um, I'm gonna compete in that thing in February. I don't see why not, there's a competition. I'll probably do like three, four training sessions, maybe five, and we'll rock and roll. We got two months, five training sessions with some good rest time in between. Sarah, you're extremely strong. Devin, obviously, you're a freaking beast, dude. Oh, my God. And uh, Nick, extremely strong. Zach, very strong as well. Um, let's see what we can do. I guess I'll be in the 180 and up, 180 to 200 pound weight class, and we'll rock and roll. I'll do a little bit of conditioning, a little bit of training. I mean, all I do is train bodybuilding. So I'm super stoked with the event, super stoked with the turnout. Even better day free diving now, that's all I gotta say. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, comment. And I'll probably be coming to a beach near you with a little stand and maybe $100 if you can beat me or Devin or Sarah in arm wrestling, who knows?